Hello Internet and goodbye Fibre Manager. My name is Mark Ashley and I basically just want to spread the word and help others get rid of Fibre Manager. I myself, I had it for 27, 28 years and it almost killed me. It really did almost kill me. I stumbled upon a cure that's worked for me just a few months ago, about two months ago now. And I'm just still so excited about being pain free, about having no more pain. It's changed my life completely. Basically what I did, I started a juice fast. I intended to do it for 15 days and after day five, I had no more pain. I was sleeping the whole night and life was awesome. So with that said, I've been making these juices each and every day. So if you watch some of my other videos, you can actually see me making the juices so you can actually follow and uh, maybe make the same juices yourself and give it a go. Uh, I decided I'm going to carry on juicing because I have no pain and I feel great. I've lost weight. Everything's just life has just changed 360 degrees for me. So it's absolutely fantastic. And for the first time in, in, in so many years, whew, I finally have a life. So anyway, Still a little bit frustrated today because my second juicer is now broken. That means not just my first juicer is in the, in the getting fixed, but my second juicer is also getting fixed. So I don't know what to do. I don't know if I could go out and buy a third juicer, but then if I go and buy a third juicer from the same company, then maybe that one just breaks again. And so I'm a little bit frustrated. But nevertheless, it's not the end of the world because today, I can still make a smoothie. So for those of you who don't know the difference, a juice with a juice machine is when you extract just the juice from the fruit or the vegetable and you, uh, you push the pulp to the side. So you're, you're only eating the juice. And a smoothie will just mix everything up. So you have the juice and the pulp together and the pulp's not bad at all. So today I'm going to make a smoothie. So today is going to be a little bit of a, a nice smoothie. I've got, I've got the shade. It's a little bit uh, dull on the video because I've got the shade because today is actually so hot outside. It's almost 30 degrees. So right now I'm going to jump in with my old mixer that I have there and I'm going to make a smoothie for you guys. So let's have a look what this is all about. Now, we, if you have fiber manager, I do suggest making either a juice or a smoothie okay this is a smoothie so today because it's so hot i'm going to make a little bit of a fruit i'm going to make a fruit uh, smoothie and it goes a little bit something like this wait for my telephone to stop here it's going to carry on ringing those are the moments where you turn off you turn off uh, any form of communication so you can make the videos and then your phone starts. So anyway, to make this movie, I have grapefruit, which I'm gonna to add to the mixer. So I have grapefruit. Grapefruit is really good for getting rid of pain. Very, very, very good. Then I have lemon. Lemon is absolutely awesome for getting rid of pain. So I'm going to throw some lemon in there as well. You, I just made sure I peeled them. That was all basically. And if you can buy, and if you can buy biological, and get biological, then I have three oranges all together. So I'm going to throw three oranges in there. Because this is a this is one just to cool down because it's so hot outside. It's actually hot in here as well. So I'm going to throw these three oranges in there as well. And as you can see, I've also got some apples, a cucumber, which is very good for the hair. And I like to have thick hair. And it also adds a little bit of water, so I don't have to use too much water myself. Of this water, so I just use the cucumber water instead. And that's where I'm also putting 
I'm going to be also putting in today, I'm going to be using some watermelon and some bananas because I love bananas. So, I've got not much in there so far. Now to get this started, we're going to have to give it a little bit of water. Because these blades need to be able to grab something so they can chew it and shred it up, which they're going to do now, I hope. Once you get that started, it's really easy. I mean, once it's, I mean, that's just already so much lovely smoothie juice in there already. So, then I have watermelon, which is surprisingly, tastes delicious watermelon anyway, and it's very, very, very healthy for you. It's a superfood. And anything that's a superfood, as far as I'm concerned, is super in my books. So, there we have it. This is a superfood. So I'm basically just throwing this in there and then I can just chew it up a little bit. What I usually do when I make smoothies, what I usually do when I make smoothies is I usually pour a little bit in the glass and I keep pouring it backwards and forwards because I love to make loads of this stuff. Yeah? When this pot doesn't actually make enough for me. So see this is almost full now already so what I usually do is I usually put this in a glass take some out so this gives me some more space because I'm not finished I am not finished people so we're gonna throw in some more watermelon and let me tell you this is really, really, really good for your fibro pain. I mean, it looks a little bit like an exotic cocktail, and it is. But this is real food. These are superfoods. This is what your body wants. If you want to get rid of fibro pain, this is what you need to give to your body. Okay? So, should use a knife for that, but instead, you tear it apart like this. The rest, juicer will do the rest, uh, the mixer will do the rest, and So I'm using both, I'm using both the glass and the pot, balance this all out a little bit because now I want to get my apples in there, mix those up as well. And afterwards, once I've got all this in, I'll actually, I'll actually mix this all back in. So now, there's a reason, so these apples don't want to so two bananas. Now this big jug of juice, 
fiber of people, it's going to last me, I don't know, it's probably going to last me until tonight. It's going to last me until tonight, and if you've thought, oh my god, my bananas are brown, people, as horrible as it may seem at first, bananas are meant to be brown. So, if you can buy bananas, if you can get them brown, or make sure you wait until they're brown and speckledy, that is when they are good for you. If you eat a banana when it is bright yellow, or green yellow, that's basically an unripe banana. And unripe bananas are not good for you. exactly how I do it. So I pour it back in there because we've got different flavours in the pot. And then give it all another mix again together. do prefer to juice, but this is what I'm going to have to live with today. This is a fantastic day for a smoothie though. Oh. <laughs> they just taste incredible. Absolutely incredible. So again, just so you know, we have in this little puppy, we have two bananas, three oranges, one lemon, one grapefruit, um, six slices of watermelon, and one cucumber and it's absolutely fantastic it's full of superfoods it's very healthy for you and I suggest you try it if you have fibromyalgia anyone most people usually have one of these blenders at home or a mixer that they can make one of these juices with try it I suggest you do a juice feast a juice fast try it for five days at least with a juicer but if you don't have a juicer you can start by reducing the pain you can start by making some smoothies. That should help. That's it for me today. If you really want to find how, if you really want to find out how I got rid of my fiber ad, fiber manager within five days, then check out my other videos. Follow some of the recipes that I show you on my juicing recipes, and give it a go. Get rid of the pain. Do it. Get rid of it. Thanks for watching. Here's to you. And goodbye, fiber manager. Cheers.